How you doing, okay? Yeah, yeah, uh, alaykum salam. I'm a, I'm a Christian, though. I know you're a Christian. Yeah. I know right. you're a Christian, but I still say salam alaykum to you. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's respect, you get me? Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, no, but it's just that I've, because I don't use Arabic expressions necessarily. It's not, you know, it, 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 it's, not, it's not a way of Arabic, it's how we've been taught to. If peace be upon you. Where are you from, though? I'm from Jamaica. Jamaica? Yeah. But uh, what's your name? My, na my, my name is Jamie. Jamie. Yeah. Um, the thing is with Islam, Islam is, apart from all sorts of other things, is also an app. We're not on this camera, are we? Maybe not, right? Turn it around. Apart, apart, from, ap apart from all other things, Jamie, apart from all other things, Islam is also Arabization. Arabization? People. That's right. But that's like me saying, how are you, Christian? What country from India, I'm guessing? Yeah. That's like me saying, oh, 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 oh. You should be Hindu or Sikh because you're from India. Why? Why Why would I say that to you? Because of where you're from. So by you saying Islam is Arabization, you're saying it's only Arab people that should be Muslim. No, that's what I'm saying. That's basically what you're trying to interpret. Though. No. Listen to my statement again. What I mean is, wherever Islam goes, it wants people to be more Arab. Not really, no. I'll no. explain. I'll explain why. Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum is not an English expression. It's not an English expression. You're right. So, um, so you why, uh, were you born and brought up here, or were I you was born and brought up here? Yeah. Here, yeah? yeah. So in the UK, uh, and do you know Arabic or do you know only English? No, I just know a few words. A few English. words. But normally your language of conversation would be English. English, yeah. yeah. So when, when speaking in English, you, there is no need to go to Arabic. For example, in English, there is a way to see, say, peace be to you. Peace be to you. That's, that's a good way of saying peace. Be why, why would I say it in English when I know it in Arabic? Exactly the point. My point. Now, if you turn that a little bit on its face, the, on its uh, yeah, face, the question is: Why would you say it in Arabic? Because, because when, in oh, Arabic, let me finish him. My Quran, let me, let my, me finish Quran, him. my Quran, and the exactly. Hadiths are written in Arabic. Exactly, that's Jamie. the language that God chose to. Exactly. To. Now exactly. you are agreeing with me, yeah. Jamie. Yeah. Do you agree with me? Yeah, that's the language that God chose. Even though, even though you're from the Caribbean. Yeah. Jamaica, yeah. you are now led to be more Arab. You are asked to read the Quran in Arabic. You are asked to even salute other people in Arabic. Maybe hadiths also in Arabic and so on. Now that's a bit of a problem. That's what I call that's what I call Arabization. That's what I call that's Arabization. Call Arabization. Ah, yeah. Let me let me give you a point. You're from yeah. India. Yeah. You're, you're, what's, what's the what's the religion in India? What's the religion of India? Many many religions. The, the main religion is Hindu and Sikh. Not the main. Yes, many it is. Religions. Hindu and Sikh. So by me saying, yeah, what me saying is Christianity, yeah, which is predominantly. Oh. What? What are you smiling at me for? <laughs> smiling at me for? I'm Jamie. By. <laughs> okay. I'm blamed. Jamie is a nice man. Is he? Yeah, well, is he? He needs. He needs to. He needs to leave Islam. That's 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 very important. Okay. Jamie, somehow. I'm going to intervene in this debate. Well, well, as I was saying, as I was saying, yeah. you're saying Islam is Arabization. Yeah. Yep. What I'm saying to you is, yeah, Christianity, which is predominantly made by the white man. Yeah. Not true. Yes. Listen, Where did listen, Christianity listen, come listen, from? Listen, listen. I'm speaking for one second. Yeah. Okay. So finish. Christianity, predominantly controlled, not made. Okay, controlled by the white man. Predominantly Catholicism. Protestant, Church of England, all that started by white people of white people. That skin over there, white people. White people. So Jamie. from them coming to your country, making me you read your Bible, their Bible in English, that's English, whatever, whatever, white, whitezation or whatever you Jamie. want to call it. It's history. What do you, I agree. I hear what you're saying. So I hear what you're saying, Jamie, but I don't agree. You, what you're saying, the, the, the claims you're making, are historically untenable. I'll give you details. Yeah, they are historically inaccurate. For example, if you roughly know, if you roughly know the history of England or the UK or Britain, you know, in stages, if you roughly know, you would understand and appreciate. All of this was uh, uh, the, the eighth, ninth century and later. Before that, there were Celts and so on. Yeah, this is the history. You know, the, these became nations later on in history. But, but, AD. First century, hey, Jamie. A AD first century, Apostle Thomas came to India, South India. Was that a white man? No, Apostle Thomas was a Jew, Jew from Israel, an Asian, an Asiatic man. 
a, a juice if you know any there are actually black, black juice you know juice, uh, juice from Ethiopia today actually migrating back to Israel from Ethiopia and, and Eritrea and so on there are white juice there are black when I say white not the European white they are they are closer to closer to the Indian yeah somewhat like that yeah so yeah you have you have black you have uh, yeah, no, it's, it's, it's so a it's a it's a it's a it's a mix of it's a mix of people a uh, mix of colors amongst the Jews but the point simply is when they when the gospel of Jesus Christ came to India came to my part of India South India England wasn't even a nation at that time so to say that the white man brought Christianity to my people is wrong historically wrong it's not just that as a matter of fact so of course we know about the North Atlantic slave trade and so on for example your ancestors you know going back you know about 10 20 generations or whatever going back to closer to the first century and so on yeah your ancestors would have predominantly come from somewhere in Africa let's say I don't know where exactly but somewhere in Africa but the point is did you know the Bible the book of Acts records black people who are Christians there is a guy called Cyrenian. But my point is, let me let me wrap up my point, Jamie. Let me wrap up my point. In other words, in other words, to claim that the white man brought Christianity to India or Africa, anywhere in Africa or anything else, is inaccurate historically, untenable. Okay, cool. These the Ethiopia became a Christian nation even before Ethiopia became a Christian nation, even before England existed, and Ethiopians are bro broadly. Maybe my color, somewhere between your color and my color. Yeah, this is the history of Christianity. It is true that white colored people also had influence. I agree, but the point is, it went beyond colors. Okay, cool. But what I'm trying to say now, it's a fact. Yeah, and you can't deny it that white people held the majority in Christianity. Yeah. It's not true. Yes, it is true. <laughs> it's not true. It's true. But it started in the Catholic Church. Jamie, it's not Church. true. It's not true. <laughs> Again, I can challenge you, Jamie. Let me tell you this. Yeah, you know, today, today, you know, today, Church of England. Um, I, I'm, I'm giving you some fact, and you will see where I'm going with this. Church of England today, unfortunately, when I say today, I mean these days, are trying to work on this LGBTQ agenda. Yeah, that's in your religion. Very unfortunate, and I'm against it. Yeah, that's in your religion. Okay, but l please listen to me. So they're, they're saying that you're, you're saying that your God told them to do that. But that, listen that to me. Please. But listen religion. to me. Listen to me, please. There is an association among. That's why the church is finished, though. Because Jamie, like that Jamie, happened, you, you need to listen to what I'm saying. Like, Jamie, you need to. church in this world. Like, Jamie, Jamie, done. Jamie, you need but to listen to me. But you're allowing gays to come in the church and get married. It's finished. Jamie, it's finished. Jamie, it's done. It's colors. Jamie, Jamie, you need to listen to me right now. This is very important. As Church of England is doing those things, yeah. there is a vast portion of Anglican Church uh, with the association called Gafcon. What's Gafcon? It's essentially an association of a worldwide association of Anglicans who still hold on to Orthodox beliefs that the Bible ought to be taken seriously, this LGBTQ and so on should be uh, binned and so on. Yeah. Are you are you listening, Jamie? The point is, would you believe the Gafcon Anglicans are the majority, and most of them are not in England. They're not no, white no, people. No, you can check the majority of Christians are Roman Catholics. I'm talking Google about Church that. of England right now. So now. But I'm talking about Christianity as a whole. I'm not talking about Church of England. I'm talking about Christianity Jamie. as a whole. Church of Catholics hold the majority, and in the Catholic Church, you're worshiping idols. Jamie, you've got statues of you say Jesus is God. You've got a statue of Jesus in the church. Jamie, you think that's a God? That's an idol. I don't believe in that. So, but well, that's your religion exactly. There's nothing Jamie, like that in Islam. Jamie, no matter how many sects you say there are, no matter how many Qurans you say there are, even though there's only one. So tell me, we don't have nothing like how do you nothing. know about the history of Islam, Jamie? What do you mean how, from what I learned on the internet? From where? No, I'm not asking. Sorry, sorry. Books. One second. Books, Google, people, Let me like, clarify. Let me clarify. Let me clarify. Let me clarify. I'm not asking, uh, Jamie. I'm not asking what books you take on board. I am asking. I'm asking. Do you know that guy? The guy who just went by. There seems to be a few very interesting guys with masks on. Nice, nice clothing. Do you know him? Um, I see. You a, think I'm black and he's got a mask, and I'm gonna know. Is that what you think? No, no. I thought you smiled at him. No, no, no. I'm smiling at you. Okay, okay. Um, so the point is, um, the point I'm trying to make is this. 
I'm not asking you for what resources you use right now to read up and so on. Any Tom, Dick and Harry could say anything today. I'm asking you for evidence. How do you get to know about Islam? You know, original sources. Which sources do you go to about the history of Islam? Original sources. I'm not talking about today's book. But the Quran doesn't give history. The Quran doesn't give history. So yes, don't course. talk about Abraham in the Quran. Okay. If he's talking about something that's the past is history, bro. Like me, I threw this bottle over there, it hit someone on the head, I talk about it next week, it's history. So Jamie, so Jamie, would you call a newspaper a history book? Bro, if he's giving references from the past is history. History is something that happened in the past. So, if I write somewhere, the Muhammad passed away 632, yeah? It's, I'm talking about something in the past. Does that mean this paper is a historical work? It might not be accurate, it might not be sufficient, Good. but it's historic. I'm it's asked, historic, bro. No. Historic. It is claiming details about history. That's my family. It's claiming details about history. I agree. But I'm, I'm trying to ask... Uh, which sources do you use? The Quran doesn't provide history. The Quran doesn't paint a picture of history. The Quran doesn't give details of where, what, happened, when, and so on. It doesn't give. Good. So from the Quran you can't do it, yeah? Because the Quran doesn't provide historical context. It doesn't. It doesn't simply. Well, yeah, okay. The hadiths, yeah. Okay, if you go to the hadiths, do you know when the earliest of the hadiths were written? Okay. Few hundred years after Muhammad, even according to Islamic tradition. You know, I'm not even questioning the tradition. I am saying, okay, tell me, I'm asking Muslims, you know, knowledgeable Muslims, oh, when when were your historical works written? And the answer I get is, like I said, 200 years later, according to their own confession, Muhammad passed away 632 AD. The first of the biographical, this is not hadith, the first one isn't hadith. The first of the biographical work years. Uh, is, uh, you know, this is biography, Sira. The first of the biographical works today that we have access to, assuming, assuming the Muslims are right in the claim of the dating of this work, is from about 200 years after. This is not Hadith. This is Sira. Hadith Sahih al-Bukhari. That's a Hadith. Earliest of Hadiths that we have access to. 846 AD. 200 and 24 years later we see 224 years later this is according to the claim but the man we don't have any manuscript from that period for this book we don't have the earliest manuscript that we have for that book comes several hundred years later in other words no one knows if you want to scrutinize no one knows when it was written you just are going by word so okay you're saying what you're saying okay and he's trying to say historical references of Islam, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So my point, Jamie, is that these are later inventions. Later documents trying to talk about earlier people. They say, let me, if, if I were to ask you, Jamie, you know, your, uh, um, have you met your grandmother in person, for example? Yeah. yeah. So let's say your great-grandmother, have you met your great-grandmother in person? No, she's still, I, I spoke to her on the phone though, she's still alive. Oh, okay, okay, uh, lo, that's very good, long life, okay. Uh, so, but you speak to her in person, but if you think about her parents, you know, someone who, in your ancestry, who you haven't actually met in person because they passed away. You know, if, if yeah, it's yeah, the previous yeah. generation. Uh, cool, yeah, great, great. Great, great, yeah. yeah cool. If you need to write about them, some history, how would you do? What I would do, I'll first go to my great grandmother. Yeah. Ask her, yeah. and I'll go to my grandmother, yeah. and I'll go to my mother, yeah. and then me. Yeah, okay. So you have you you have these points that you can go a to. A timeline, yeah? Yeah, a timeline that you can go to. But if you were to provide, if you were to, if, if I were to ask you for a historical work that others could use of your fourth generation ancestor, you know, the, uh, not your great grandmother, the fifth generation ancestor. If I were to ask you to write a historical work for others to use, not just for you to use, you trust your mother, you trust your grandmother, but others may not. We don't know your mother. We, 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 so therefore, we can't take her word for it. Yeah. But then again, you remember you asked the question of if I wanted to write something about my 
family. Yeah, I know, I know. It's only I, I, I'm changing. Belief. Absolutely. It doesn't matter if, if they don't believe. Exactly. It, so. Now I'm giving. Uh, uh, well, Same I, with the hadith. It's only beneficial to the Muslims and people that want to believe. Jamie, you are a Muslim right now. Yeah. Yeah. I'd like to find out if the hadiths are beneficial to you as a Muslim, and that is where I'm no, asking. I'm asking you that. No, I know, Jamie. Like, like, and that is where. One second. Let, let me just. Let me ask. Let me ask one question. And then, and then you can combine that. Because that is the ultimate question I want to ask. Sahil, friend, absolutely. I want him to come. But I like. If I don't ask this question, then all the con. Yeah, good. Sahil Bukhari. Sahil Bukhari. Jamie as a person, or you as a uh, this gentleman as a person. What's your name? Muhammad is a person, Jamie or Muhammad is a person. How do you personally, either you or you, personally know, how can you personally verify that Sahih Al Bukhari did his research properly, was not a lazy man sitting somewhere making things up on his own, but actually did his research properly and got information, got information from knowledgeable sources truly. Uh, how would you know? give you the, um, the answer sure so keep this answer there but I'm gonna lay you my question that I told you before when you said let me finish yeah so I'm gonna give you that question quickly before I answer to you okay completely what you want to know. first of all your whole you believe in the New Testament right I do thank you very much the New Testament most of it is written by who my many disciples of but the Lord Jesus the majority is who right Oh, the majority of the New Testament, you know, everybody. Many writings by Paul. Yeah. 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 Do you know who have never seen Jesus, have never met him, and when they ask him, how do you know that's the word of Jesus, he said, it's a revelation. So the whole his religion is built in something like that, that he's telling his power The whole, did you say the whole? No, if you, if you, so majority of the Old Testament. The, old, the New, New Testament. Testament. New Testament. So with the New Testament. Did he say whole or majority? No, I said majority. I mean, so okay, the, okay, go so on. So the majority, and majority, most of the things that came through Paul, yeah, he said he never met Jesus, he never saw him. And matter of fact, he just said he's got visions. That's not me saying that Christian, he knows what I'm talking about. So he had visions about the word of Jesus. So that's, that's cool, right? And guess what? Another story happened. Paul, he was doing certain things against the Christianity. So the covenant, the people, the one that told him to shave his head, you know the story. When they asked Paul, did you say this? Are you going to ask a question oh, and move on to what I asked? Or you did not know what's going on? Basically, what happened, Paul done something against the, the I thought you the heard a question. Right? Yeah. And they called them, so the covenant of the people, the priests at the time, that they said that Jesus had called them. Right? And when they come, they said, did you do that? He said, no. So they said, to prove it, shave your head. So he shaved his head to show that he followed the Old Testament and he never told people that Jesus fulfilled everything. That's a story. So that is the also for you to say Islam and why you believe that. You're basically majority of you believe is building the visions, which you believe it. Now we come to Sahih al Bukhari. No, no, wow, 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 you are a witness. I thought he had a question to me. Yeah, okay, he cool. said, Jamie, no, question. one second. Yeah, one, no, uh, Jamie, but so far... How we know the hadiths are authentic? Boom. I said something here. Yeah. The hadiths, when someone was to go speak a hadith, yeah, about the experience, that person, they could not be a bad person. They could have never been caught lying in their life. They could have never been got anything bad again. If, any, if people had bad things to say about that person, so the hadith was authentic. Be? Jamie, that's really good. Yes. No, moment, moment, moment. So the people have to know they're never going to be a liar. Yeah. Matter of fact, someone, you need to give hadith. So someone, he learned that one person know about hadith about the Prophet So he went to the house to get the hadith. Muhammad, Muhammad, you have, you have, in honesty, you are hijacking the conversation. He's his donkey car. Yeah. He's lying to the donkey. His hadith is dying. You can't take it. That's how it is. That's how it is. I, I hear, I hear what you've said. So one second, Sahih al-Bukhari, and no, all of these people built from him, I have, to him is a chain. Good, I heard what you and said. Memorized. But can I, can yeah, I, go on, go on ahead, go ahead. I have a great problem right now. The problem is, you are giving me belief statements. I'm hearing belief statements right now. I asked you a specific question. The question is, I didn't ask you what you believe about the hadiths. If that was my question, How did you could tell me. If that was, sweetie, if that was the question, if that was a, sweetie, if that was a question, if that was a question, then you can give me belief statements. 
Yeah. That's not a, that's not belief statements. That's facts. How do you mean? You know, claims, assertions. It's fine. Why do Jamie, you listen to me, Jamie. Is true? Assertions are. Why do you believe everything? Jamie, Jamie. Is true? I'll come there. Assertions are facts only when backed by evidence. Okay, but why I do you agree believe? You. Why do you believe everything that Paul said? Who? He got vision. I'm, I'm, I'm going to. I'm going to come. I'm going to come. I'm going to come. I'm going to come. I'm going to come to that, yeah, but to no, 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 I know, whoa, 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 now, Muhammad, you need to, you need to be genuine, the genuine, well, if you are genuine, you need to stick to this point, which is, I was in a conversation, you said that you would want to ask a question, which you'd want me to answer later, and you said before that we can finish this discussion, that's what you said, and so I'm asking, I'm asking, and that's where, uh, uh, in regards to trusting in hadiths, the question is, Jamie, in regards to trusting in hadiths, claims anyone can make. You know, if you go to India, there will be claims that oh, some guy is a, is a god today. There are plenty of people who even claim to be god today. Yeah, anyone can claim anything. Anyone can claim anything. Question is, what is true? So, uh, Muhammad is a young man. Muhammad is a young man. You are a young man. Now you need to when you when you follow uh, when you follow literature, you need to have evidence for its authenticity. That's what I'm asking. What you gave are belief statements. Belief statements. Are you, is he going to help us? Please come in. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. So what? How do you know, Jamie? How do and Muhammad? How do you know? that Sahih al-Bukhari is reliable. How do you know? Because his criteria is stringent and robust. Do you know the five conditions that makes a Sahih? I'm asking now. Excuse me. No, 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 Excuse me, excuse me, listen, excuse me, no, 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 listen to me carefully. Was he going okay. to help you? you know? I, I'm, I'm looking for an answer from you. I'm not asking for an answer from you. Five conditions. Now you've got Adel. Number one is Adel, trustworthiness. Number two, uh, there should be no hidden defects. Number three, it does not affect the integrity of the text. Number four, uh, there's no broken in the chain of narration. And number five, uh, there has to be precision and accuracy. These are belief the statements. These I'm asking for evidence. The that is evidence. These are the five. That's belief no, statements. No, no, I'm no, asking, no, I'm how would I'm Jamie, testing. excuse me, I'm asking for it's evidence. Cool, I'm asking for evidence, answer. Jamie. Jamie, answer. you are a young man. No, you you know the five. Five. Jamie, no, 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 Jamie. I'm asking for evidence, not belief statements, Listen, not that's more of belief that's statements. Like that's like me saying to you, you give me evidence know. that Jesus I'm Christ died on the cross. Give me evidence. Absolutely, you can ask Where's the evidence? I can give you. Where's the evidence? I'll give you. See. I want to see now. Okay. I want to see now. Now, before we continue, so I want to see evidence that okay. Jesus Christ got killed by Romans. I okay. want to see that. Okay. Let me see. Okay. Let me see. I'm and I want to see evidence that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. I'm going to answer. I'm going to answer. I'm going to answer. I'm going to answer. You want, you want, you want evidence for the crucifixion of Jesus? Where is the evidence? I'm going to answer. The crucifixion. For the crucifixion of Jesus, Christians witness accounts. <laughs> for the crucifixion. Are you going to listen? Are you going to listen? No, we're not, we're not doing that. You know why? Are you going to listen, Jamie? Jamie, are you going to listen? Are you not going to listen? Jamie, are you not going to listen, Jamie? Bro, now you're saying questions are coming. Hey, nice, 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 um, nice, um, what's that? Go? Are you so afraid of COVID-19 yeah, or what? Yeah, uh, we're covered. No, no, but is this COVID-19? are still uh, immunodepressed, so we have to wear masks. Uh, so, okay, so this is your new, okay, that's good. I see, okay. Nice. So you are terribly afraid of COVID-19, yeah? But so when I when I see you elsewhere, you would be still wearing these masks. Oh, nice, nice. All right. Uh, interestingly, interestingly, you know. No, one second. Once I'm, I'm dealing with some other. Answer that question, Jamie. Jamie, I'm dealing with some other. I, I want to come there, but before that, I want, I'm dealing with something else. You know, Hatun, a Christian preacher at the park. A few months ago, she was stabbed. Yeah, and no, and and the fashion sense of the person who stabbed Hatun is very similar to yours. 
very similar. And so, things have been reported, things are being monitored, excuse me, things are being reported, things are being monitored, young people, young people, no, 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 I'm asking you, I'm asking you gently, I'm asking you gently to be wary of that. Very similar fashion sense. People are watching. Okay, very good. Okay, can you answer my question now? No, I need. This is very important. I know, but you, they, they listen to. Do you believe? Do you believe in the fact that Islam? You know, Hatun being attacked. Are you happy with that, Jamie? Jamie, ask me the same question. Why do you believe? Jamie. That what Paul said is true. Going to go and read your book. Ask him the same question. Well, don't be able. Hatun being. Allah, he will answer. Well. Hatun so being. Don't go around. Hatun he being naive. Us, are you happy he with that? He said to us, how do you know that the hadith is right? No, but question, Jamie. Jamie, question, are you happy with it's that? It's got nothing to do with Islam. I don't incite violence on women, so but no. Are you happy with that? How, how, how am I going to be happy with that? You know, in fact, good, I've very good. Know. How do you know it's true? Are you happy with Hatun being naive? No. How do you know that spoon is the shoe? Answer my question. Ah, okay. He's so, but before that, are we agreed that you don't yeah, have yeah, a defense for Hadith? We agree with that. Let's go. No, no, no. Hadith. Hadith. Are we, Jamie yes, hasn't yes, provided yes, evidence agree with that. to back up why do you the reliability why? of hadiths. He just gave me five, just gave five, me five belief why? statements. Why? How do you know, Jamie? Why is not answering? Jamie, One question. Jamie. Uh, cool, cool, cool. Give me evidence of Jesus Ooh. Christ's crucifixion. Why? Jamie. Let's finish that. Evidence, no, 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 like evidence of Jesus Christ. And then I'll come back to hadiths, yeah? Okay, cool. Evidence of Jesus Christ. And then and I'll come back to this. Why does he believe Paul what he said is true? Who said he got visions? And Someone then I'll come back. And, and, uh, and, and he believes it. And then I'll How come back to this. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Evidence for crucifixion yeah. and then I'll come back go, to this. Yeah? Muhammad. Okay, because you're not answering my question. You run away from Paul's question. Why do you run away from it? Muhammad. I'm, back to I'm speaking to Jamie. And Jamie's asking you the same question. Jamie. He is asking about you, crucifixion. No, uh, uh, asking about <laughs> Evidence asking for about crucifixion? Isn't that what you asked? We're going to ask you two questions and then will you ask us a question. When so are you going to come to the hadiths? After you've answered our two questions. Good. After I've answered those two specific okay, questions, yeah, we, yeah, we you are going to come to the hadiths, yeah? yeah? yeah. Good. Evidence of Jesus, Jesus, is, that's the first question. The second one is about Paul. Who uh, got a vision? How do you know the vision are not from the devil? And the yeah, that's okay. I want to know that. That's good. how the book was written. Okay, good. That's how the Bible was written. Good. So. Why are you moving paranoid? <laughs> well, there are many nutters at the park. There are many nutters at the park. Many nutters at the park. No, that's serious stuff. That's very serious stuff. Have you seen Christians going around attacking other people? Yes. Really? Yes. Where? Yes. Jamie, which, which Christian have you seen doing that? A lot of Christians. A lot, a lot, a lot. A lot of Christians. Okay, cool. Where are you going? Oh, five. Where's the evidence of Jesus Christ? Jesus Christ is crucifixion. Tacitus. Tacitus is a historian. A Roman historian of the first century yes. who ruled or who governed a portion of Turkey and he records, Jamie are you listening? He records in his historical work that Jesus was crucified under Pontius Pilate. Have you met that man? Have you met that man? Yes or no? What's the crucifixion? Met who? The man that you just told me about. Why should I meet the man? So how do you know he's telling the truth? <laughs> Bro, no, no, that, Jesus at least, at least he's no, asking no, a better no, question. Exactly, yes, how do you, that's, okay, that's, no, no, that's no, no, leave that, leave that, leave that. Uh, forget cool. about, forget what about, he's, he's smiling because you know. No, 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 no. You know why you're smiling? I don't know what you're talking you know about. I don't know what you're talking about. Leave, leave, leave the crucifixion. Okay, so ask the second question. No, 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 first question. So, Jamie, he asked a better question. He asked me, how do I know that Tacitus is reliable? Now, this is where you need to read upon Tacitus. Tacitus was not a Christian. He was not writing a work on the history. If you don't mind, I'll stay a little bit away. Yeah, I don't. I don't like this one. Go that way. Let me start this side. You stay yeah. that side. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Okay. I'll. I'll stay here. You. You can stay there. Tacitus. 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 Jamie. Tacitus is a Roman historian, well attested as a secular Roman historian. Are you listening? Well attested. Well attested as a secular Roman historian. He, is, he doesn't have any ulterior motive 
to support the Christian belief system because he was not a Christian historian. No, but I don't want him. I want the Jesus disciple. What you want to say? Jamie, Jamie, Jamie. Only need to know a little bit of the first century Roman history to understand that Tacitus is a neutral source of information. Neutral source of information. You have given an Islamic information in terms of Sahih al Bukhari. I have every reason to question him, challenge him, because he is an Islamic source. I'd like to question and challenge more. And I'm because who? So why okay, you answer about okay, forget, forget. No, I'm talking about crucifixion. Are you happy? You answer the question. Jamie, so far, are you happy? You answer the question. You ask for the evidence. You ask for an evidence for the crucifixion? Tacitus. Did you get that point clearly? Good. This is very important. Now very <laughs> weak. It's a very I, 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 I give I give a historian I give I give I give I give I give the work of a historian who is an unbiased historian you don't take it seriously what do you want me to do but how how do you why can you not answer one question? Who now? Because, because your one question was the second question, third question as a matter of fact. the second question. Third, third. Who got visions? And he said that's what Lord and Jesus said. What's that? We don't want to be recorded. That's fine, you can stay away. We're, he's recording, you can stay away. You can stay away. You can move, move off the camera if you don't like. No yeah, yeah, that's fine. Who never made no Jesus one is supposed to be repeating. Why do you write this stuff about Jesus? No, no, no. It's a simple thing, my dear friend. You came over here. We were discussing already. I had to argue about the camera. I just spoke with him. It's done. How do you know? That's it. You just what? I just spoke with him. It's done. How did you know? Good, good. Good. Answer! That, that one question, don't want to answer it. No, 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 no. Answer now, please. I'd answer. like to know if Jamie appreciates a historical he work. Appreciate. He doesn't seem to. He does. He's at BS or something. He will appreciate when you answer that question about Paul. He will appreciate. Go on. So don't care about historical works that I'm presenting. You will never answer why, question. Why? No, I can answer to Jamie when he comes. Jamie. Comes later on. Jamie said he will answer to you when you come back. Jamie well, left you. Because later you don't on. That question, in in your company, it doesn't seem to be making sense. But but Muhammad, you have been reasonable. Jamie and Muhammad, you need to okay. Now come. If you want to talk about, you want to talk about, you want to talk about Paul. What is the problem? Many many people have this false idea. Yeah, but who's that, who? I'm answering right now. About him? I'm answering right now. Many people have a false idea about Paul. Now, to answer, do you believe in revelations? I just want to answer that question. No, what no. What made you believe what Paul said is true? You know what he made me? Saw Jesus, he never saw Jesus. According to you? No, according to the, everyone. Everyone knows. Jesus. According to you? So Paul, did, so Paul met Jesus. Yes. Of course he did. Where? Well, on the road so to Emmaus. On the road to Emmaus, he spoke to Jesus. So Paul was the, the life at the same time as Jesus. Listen to me carefully again. On the road to Emmaus, are you listening? Sorry, uh, uh, not Emmaus. On the road to Damascus. On the road to Damascus, Paul spoke to Jesus. Spoke. Paul even around the same time as Jesus. Okay, this is where you haven't done your research properly. <laughs> Listen to me again, Muhammad. This is very important. On the road to Damascus. So he met Jesus. He spoke, he met Jesus, he spoke to Jesus. Physically. Why physically matters? Why, why, why should it be physically? If you, if you speak... So, you, do you use a mobile phone? So, the spirit of Jesus. Do you, do you use a mobile phone? Jesus called him in the phone. No, do you use a mobile phone? And do you speak to people over a mobile phone? Is that a valid conversation? Yes. Good. Paul spoke to Jesus. How? Well, how, how, how does it matter? He spoke to Jesus. Are you not, let, are you listening? Yeah, please bring him in. <laughs> so, Muhammad was taken back by surprise that I told him that Paul spoke to Jesus. Well, no, 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 Jamie, 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 he said, do you speak to someone? Jamie, Jamie, I, he, uh, Muhammad earlier said, Jamie, 
Muhammad earlier said, Paul never met Jesus, never spoke to him. Face to face. That's what, no, 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 face to face is a new idea that you're talking about right now. What's that? The vision is not the same as me and stuff. But, but listen to me carefully. The question I'm addressing are two, the question, I'm addressing two specific points. In both of these points, I'm not using the word vision. Note carefully. What do you mean? I, 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 let me clarify. He earlier said Paul never met Jesus. Physically. Ah, physically. And that, he seems to think, he seems to think only physical meetings are interactions. Do you that's agree what, with that? That's what meetings mean. That's what meetings mean. Have you, don't, don't you have Zoom? No, no, wait, 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 Kalas, 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 do you believe, do you believe, do you meet people over internet today? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Is that a, is that a valid meeting? Yeah, good. Are you physically with them during the meeting? But I know they're physically with me. No. Are they, are they physically with you? No, clearly not. So no no don't ram no you okay, need to be clear uh, no, no, no 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 Jamie one second one second Jamie one second Jamie one second the claim the claim the claim that only physical meetings are valid meetings reliable meetings is incorrect if that were the case you cannot use Zoom can't use your mobile phone to speak to someone. If None of them is reliable. Dream, it's the same as me and him. I'm not talking that's about dreams that's right that's now. That's is question. Zoom meeting a dream? Yeah. Is Zoom meeting a dream? No. Why is he talking about a dream? I don't know. I am talking no, about, about Paul. Paul now, Paul on the road to Damascus saw Jesus. People around him saw Jesus. He spoke to Jesus. He asked a question, received answer. His eyes were blind, blinded. He went further on to Damascus and uh, Ananias had to pray for him, for him to be healed of his blindness. So, speaking, seeing, no, listen, no, no listen. See, Jamie, 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 don't be confused by Mohammed. Mohammed, I'm giving honest facts. He's changing goalposts. Paul saw Jesus, spoke to Jesus, was healed by Jesus. All three are important. No, he wasn't healed by Jesus. He wasn't healed by Jesus. He who was, was he healed by? He was healed by one of the disciples. I know that story. Like who? I used to be a, I used to be a Christian. Can? I used to go to church. Good. <laughs> well done. I know that one. I know that story. <laughs> it wasn't Jesus who was healed by. Come here. I know that one. He called you. 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 Jamie. I thought he was. I thought he was. Jamie. 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 You're a lovely man. Remember that story. Jamie. You're a lovely man. Jamie. You are a lovely man. You need to come back to Jesus Christ. Jamie. You're a lovely man. Jamie. Jamie. You're a lovely man. He's a lovely man. You need to come. He is. No, he genuinely, he genuinely is a lovely man. Now, Jamie, 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 now answer me, answer me, answer me right now. Jamie, 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 answer me. Could, Jamie, Jamie, answer me. Could Ananias heal out of his own volition? Can he heal? No, it's still good. Ah, well done. And so, it is not the disciple. Oh God. So Jesus not, can't heal because Jesus Christ said the Son of God, he's not God, he's a prophet sent by God to deliver a message. I'm, and he can heal by the Can a prophet of Jesus Christ can a prophet speak God. from heaven? What? Can a prophet speak from heaven? Well, can a prophet speak from heaven? Simple question. More than likely not. A human being. No, 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 not more than likely. Speak every day. Death. So, no. After they are gone from this world, can they speak from heaven? In the knowledge of God, we don't know. We don't no, I'm know. asking we don't him. We don't know. No, no. Oh, Jamie, the one you read, the Bible you read, what does it say as to what happened to Paul on the road to Damascus? Who spoke to him? From heaven, who spoke? Could it be the devil? Could be someone? No, I'm, someone asking, I'm asking. I'm asking him. No, 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 wait. Mohammed, I'm asking him. Mohammed, you don't know the Bible. He has read the Bible. Let's listen to him, please. Cool, cool. Jamie, what did you read in the Bible? Well, who did Paul speak to from heaven? Who, whose was the voice? Answer. Now he has gone quiet. Now he has gone quiet. There we go. We didn't see him. We didn't see him. We didn't see him. Ah, that's not the question asked. Jamie, Jamie, that's not the question asked. The question asked was, Jamie, that's not the question asked. The question asked was, the question asked was, 
Could a prophet speak from heaven after he had left the world? He wasn't killed. He wasn't killed. Everyone knows Jesus Christ didn't die. You're yeah, answering a question which was never asked. Same, same way he's going to come back. Jamie, same way he's going to come you back. You are an expert right now in answering a question which was never asked. That's not the question I asked. The question I asked was simple. The question I asked was simple. What is the question? Could a prophet speak from heaven after he had left the world? If God allowed him, if God allowed him. Oh, there we go. How many of the prophets have done that? How many of the prophets have done that? We don't know. We, don't know. we didn't die. We don't know. We don't know. Do you believe in See, prophets speaking from heaven? We don't know. If God allows it. Is God allowed it? Yeah. All right. <laughs> if God says let it happen, it can happen. Okay. This is new Islamic theology. This is new Islamic theology. One second. Islamic theology 3.0. He's saying... Does can the prophet speak from heaven or ever? I don't know. What, what do you Allah. mean you don't know? No, 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 Who can speak from heaven? I don't know. I didn't die. I don't know. Who can never speak from heaven? Nobody. When nobody could speak from heaven that he knows of, how did Jesus speak to Paul? So clearly that's outside of Islamic remit. But clearly, Jamie, but did you see? That is clearly outside of Islam. What, what is Jesus outside? being able to speak from heaven is clearly outside of the remit of Islam. So Jesus got Very important so for you to Clearly, that's what you find. So when he that's said what Paul found. So one second, when he said you don't know about the hour. Well, no, you're now going on to some other question now. No, 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 he doesn't. You don't want Jesus to stick to one to topic. Do we agree? Muhammad, do we agree that Paul spoke to Jesus do we agree that Paul saw Jesus? No. Do we? Oh, okay. Oh, so you're just the one that said. I think he spoke to. I think the vision is. Sorry, sorry. I think he's got. All right. So That's in that case, you're asking, you're asking your opinions so. don't matter to me. I don't think. Did he see him? Did he see him? Did he see him or did he hear? Yeah. Who Paul? Yeah. Saw and heard. Okay. Physically. Uh, ask him that. Yeah. Physically. Physically. Why does physically matter? Uh -huh. That's a concern he wants to bring in. Why? I won't lie to you, it's a bit of a, like, what is a, okay, listen, you can't just give an opposing theory without evidence, right? Like, what are you saying? Okay, let's say he didn't physically meet him, but, but, just follow me, follow my logic. But all what he said still happened, still happened. What does it matter? One second. No, he said, but that's what the thing. Who? He saying Pooley went to Damascus and saw on the yeah, mountain yeah. and that man was supposed to be Jesus yeah. and he saying and Jesus told him things yeah. and then Pooley started writing the New Testament. That's not true. Now, Muhammad, you, you're it's making fine, things up. Fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, go on. Okay, continue. Continue. Yeah, it's alright. It's alright. Right. Right. So right, go on. How do you know that what he saw on the mountain is Jesus? Okay, so you asked a good question now, but again, I need to I need to give you the entire story. Yeah? Paul, in terms of his contribution to the Bible, comes from a wider context, much wider than what you have in your mind. Yes. Number one, number one, Paul personally, first of all, when he saw Jesus, when he spoke to Jesus, there were people around him. Number one, people around him also heard the sound but from you, heaven. Okay, pause, no, no. one second, wait, hold yeah. on. So what do you have to say, Sam? Because listen to this, yeah? let's just be a bit consistent. It's all right for one man to be the man. It's, it's literally... Impossibly, we've never heard it where a group of people. That bro, there is no other that historians have written about what no. he's saying. No other people in the history that said, yeah, he was there when Paul. Because you know, I see certain stories, yeah, you can find other outside of Bible or Christianity yeah. can back it. Yeah. So they can say, yeah, the historians. But listen, if I'm going to go by that logic, but if I'm going to back it, you know why that's the same? Only Paul and only him and his vision. Who, who, what? Did you hear what I said last? You're saying only Paul heard. Because he's making sense to me. Sorry. Let me go, look, by that logic here, let me go by that logic here. Of you not, I know you're a Muslim, innit? you've not really seen the outside sources. In terms of, let's say, let's talk no, about, did, let's talk about the historical evidence yeah. for the crucifixion. There's a way more, way more stuff supporting that is, it's, 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 it's pretty much a historical fact that Jesus. Died. I don't know if you know. No, if this is not even this is historians and scholars that aren't even Christians. Facts. So if we go, this crucifixion of Jesus. No, yes. Get your phone out right now. No, I agree with you, but no, one person of Jesus' disciples has spoken about. About what? Is it not the odd? About what? what? One of the Jesus' disciples was there when the thing happened. When the old fled. He's a man. The, the old fled. All Jesus' disciples. Who told you this? So they didn't fled. No, okay. Would you like to listen to my yeah, answer? I am, I am. I am. Okay. <laughs> no, I know about the Christianity. I'm not saying the answer. All I know about the story 
the majority of the side would have fled then the one day when the things happened. No, okay, so yes, yes, can but I, that was at certain times, yeah, they, some did When he was getting crucial, right? Not all of them, though. So, not, like, not all of them. No, so it's like, what, the, 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 right, so that gone. means some of them did flee. Can I, can I respond to you, yeah, Mohammed? In a moment, I genuinely think that you are a lovely block. I do. No, please. In 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 the half an hour of speaking to you, you were sincere. I know you are wrong. Uh, I'm actually I, trying to answer a question. This I know, I know. Please listen to me. I know, I know you are attempting to be sincere. I know you've got your facts wrong, but I know you are attempting to be sincere. I really appreciate that. Yeah, because I'm still trying to learn. I know, I know. And that is where. That's nice. I admit that. And that is where I'd like to communicate clear facts to you right now because some of your ideas are not wrong, uh, right i'd like to communicate so okay in terms of the crucifixion of jesus you need to be aware that the crucifixion of jesus on the day of the crucifixion was a monumentally was a monumental event in the region of judea of that time monumental Bro, you need to do the evidence. Bro, let me see. Even your Islamic scholars like this is a this is a problem answering the crucifixion. There's a big dispute and arguments about it. Like it's literally put if we have to follow science, it's actually cool. I agree. It's a, with I'm you. telling you, but if you see it, I can show you something. I, no, I know, but there is something that I read myself. I got it. So nobody is I cool. I'm not a scholar or anything like that. I just do a little research yeah. there. That's fine, that's cool. And for example, when the, the story in the tomb. Yeah, in the tomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me personally, I read the full gospel and they were all different stories to each other. Yeah. So one said that the, the, the yeah. truth was there, yeah. the other one said no, he wasn't Okay, so there. let me tell you. So uh, how do I know the truth or not? That's a good question. Let me tell you, even in police work here, what they do, silence doesn't mean... No, just, just follow me. Silence doesn't mean denial. talking about God here. No, I know, no, no, but listen, listen to human... No, listen. So this is humans that wrote the gospel. Sometimes we, we don't... You don't have to think so much like boom this is human so listen even mark mark which is seen to be the earliest gospel they didn't he didn't have the evidence of the basically they, they, he doesn't speak about the virgin birth and people question this people question it's like bro why doesn't mark because you read the four gospels right like you just told me you're not lying are you no i said that story i know i know so, so just follow but just follow my logic just follow me. mark didn't have the virgin birth in there but i don't know that it's fine it's fine it's fine, it's fine but that's not a problem because even there's a okay so there's a place in mark where it says they refer to him as the son of Mary and this was against Jewish tradition Jewish tradition what they would do is call it the son of Joseph so this indicates to us already that he was very short of the he was very short of the uh, the information around uh, Jesus birth virgin birth but he didn't mention it but does that mean that his facts and his and his evidence is now not plausible do we now deny it just because that that's not how it works because yeah, silence but, doesn't mean the now that's what yeah it is but that now. is one and if I could add to that one more statement I would say, personally, uh, there would be a problem only if all four Gospels say the same stuff. That is where, that is where there would be, so then you would ask, need to ask the question, did they copy from each other or what? If you, if you, no, there are four of us here, no, Mohammed, please, please, let me, let me just finish this once. Four of us are here, if you ask the four of us here as to what was happening just there, you know, after five minutes, Sorry, if you bro, ask if us... If we're all there, we're going to hold, have the same version, bro. That's not true. That's not true. That's not true. Yeah. That's, yeah. Not true. Listen, that's not true. Simply not true. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, once, 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 because it's all going to be the same anyway. What? Please tell me his version. There's my point. No, no, please tell me his version. Let me just say. No, but do you see my point here? I see, I see your point. The thing I want to say is, his, his silence doesn't mean like they contradict each other. That's true. But there is a lot of things where it doesn't necessarily, it's not that there's silence, it's they actually contradict each other. They don't. They do? No, nope, they don't. No, trust me. I've, I've, I don't trust me, I do my research on this. Thing, age, bring me one contradiction. Bring me one contradiction. Yes, yes. Listen, now listen. Bring me one contradiction. You know, King Ahaziah. You're talking about the King Isaiah, yeah? No, 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 Gospels, yeah, no, no, the King crucifixion Isaiah? and resurrection. You know, you know the co-regency? That's it, thank you. The they don't know this. They don't know this. They just want to bring in no, theories. No, no, wait, wait, wait. They no, don't no, know. No. Prince William, Prince William, he's the king. <laughs> His promotion has done. Go further on. It's very important, well, Muhammad. You had some interesting ideas. You, yeah? uh, Muhammad, you had some interesting ideas, but time and time again, 
you were talking about Paul earlier. Now we are talking okay, about the crucifixion account. One second. Yeah. Time and time again, what we are finding is what you had as comprehensive facts are being revised. Are being revised. So I'd like to encourage you, Mohammed. Is but you come across as a real gentleman, honest in your approach. So I'd really like to comment to you. This is my challenge as a Christian. I have been researching, like you said, you have been researching, and I appreciate your Sorry, research. When we ask you the one thing about hadith, you didn't know the five fundamental no. simple thing that we Muslims. Who, Muslim Who told you I didn't know? Who told you I didn't know? When he asked about you, didn't know. Why? I shouldn't. So I can you repeat it for me again? Muhammad, Muhammad, wait a second. Muhammad, Muhammad. I want Muhammad, Muhammad, Muhammad. Same as you learn from Muhammad. No, no. Please listen. No, I listen to you. So let me finish. Okay. Same as we am learning from you about things about Christianity. Yeah. When we come to about certain things about Islam, and that brother brought it to you, and he said about hadith and what the five criteria we use you should know them i because know it I mean, don't worry I, I, do, I can they, 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 uh, can i show you from look i'll tell him sorry one second just to add on is it about when the king has a son Oh, I mean, okay. The Quran, I've got the word. There's also, I've heard the word about the census. There was, uh, there was apparently a census. What's that? There was a census apparently done twice in the last That's not crucifixion. You're talking about no, crucifixion. You're talking about crucifixion. I thought we were talking in general about the... Well, okay, anyway, then time. that's fine. Anyway, because... That's cause, fine cause, also. You can bring general also. The Bible is very reliable. No inconsistency. What's the problem with the census? So for example, there is in the, the Gospels, there is two that happened in the lifetime of Jesus, but historically, there is, we don't find them. During the time of uh, the Gospels, two happened? No, Gospels, Jesus. There's a census, apparently. I've, I've heard, I've, two, I've heard two censuses? Census, yeah, two censuses. One in the Bible? In the Gospels, yeah. No. Which one? Which two do you have? What the census? census is like when you calculate the population, is that right? Yeah. Is that, yeah. There's no two, uh, as far as I remember, there's no two mentioned. Because I watched the debate about it and I'm pretty sure there is. I, I, I know what you're trying to, uh, I know the, I know that you have watched something, I know that, because I know that there's a particular argument that people make, yeah. that, that's not what you're making, no. Okay, I'll make sure of it, I mean, I'll, I'll revise that. Okay, okay revise sure. That, there's a lot of things. What's I've your watched, name? Amir. 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 Good to see you. First time here at Speaker's Corner? No, no, I've came several times. Several times, okay. So, Amir, I'd really like, do you, are you with together? Or? Yeah, yeah. Okay, friends, okay. okay. Amir, I'd really like you to find out the details. And that's my email address. Email address. Okay. Yeah, yeah, please, Mohammed. Please go to. Thank you, No, Mohammed is a, he's a lovely man. He's all fun, man, as well, man. You get what I Mohammed, lovely man. Thank you, yeah. Lovely man. Mohammed, you asked me whether I know about. Uh, the Bukhari's criteria. I do my research. I go back in my prayer time. Okay, good show. Sure. Catch up later. Okay, catch up later. God's blessings, God's blessings, God's blessings, brother. God's blessings, brother. God's blessings, I mean. See you later. All right. So, this is what we're dealing with again for the Bible, for the Christian beliefs. We have solid evidence why we believe in crucifixion, why we believe in the resurrection why we believe in Paul's writings, why we believe in the rest of the New Testament. We have solid evidence to claim that Paul never met Jesus Christ. It's an unhistorical claim. Paul met Jesus Christ. Paul saw Jesus Christ. Paul spoke to Jesus Christ. Paul was healed by someone who was sent by Jesus Christ. That's the history that we know of. Other people around Paul also saw Paul speaking to Jesus Christ. This is what we find in regards to Islam again. Islam is a set of fantasy ideas, claims, claims not... Well, why, why don't you listen to what I'm talking about right now? Do you have a problem? Good, thank you, good to know. Good to know, thank you. You weren't paying attention when I was speaking about Jesus Christ, were you?